Welcome everyone, I'm Crystal Shalee, your host for Popcorn Picks, as we preview what's playing in theaters this week. Grab a bag of popcorn, a drink, and I have a seat for you as we watch what's playing. So sit back and relax and enjoy the show. I was going to late. ABS Q-U-A-T-U-L-A-T-E. That's correct. Who's next? The spelling bee is meant for kids. Rule number 24, the speller must not have passed beyond the eighth grade on or before February 1st. As you can see there, I have not passed the eighth grade. Not ever. Hi, I'm Chaitani Chopra. What's your name? Spin it around. What was your winning word? What was the word you spelled to win your regional? To get here. If you don't point that curry hole that way and sit your ass down on that seat, I'm going to tell the captain that your bag's ticking. Welcome, everyone, to the National Spelling Bee. Hey, God. Hey, Slumdog. What are you doing up on the stage, weirdo? Your chair called me for help. It's like, help me. It's so heavy. Why, at the age of 40, have you decided to annoy educators, parents, and children by forcing your way into a kid's spelling bee? Can I give you a little journalistic advice? I know you're not suggesting that I let you sleep with me again. First of all, you're welcome. Oh, look who's here. I was wondering if you wanted to study together. Let's go for it. All right, so you don't have any friends. I bet you crush ass, though. We make up for it with the women? Nope. When I do get one, it's going to be a girl with nipples. They all have nipples, pal. No, they don't. They do. Hit it. I'm not that good at thinking things through. And that's why this plan was such crap. Losers lose, Mr. Trilby. Well, you don't know me, and you don't know why I'm here. Oh. Did I leave my underpants in your room last night? Oh, as a matter of fact, you... I don't know. I'm Guy. I'm not supposed to talk to you. Can you give these to your mother? She left those in my room last night, and she was very sweet. I want you to know that. She held me afterwards, and... A nice woman. Want to get ice cream now? Screw ice cream. Where the hell is she going? Let's go ask her. Marzipan! You were issued a private investigator's license for your 18th birthday? What do you think that says about a person? Compulsive, addictive personality, but that's not me anymore. My daughter, the big shot New York lawyer. You're destined for greatness. I've oversold you. My parents don't think that I could have landed a creature such as the one that I've described. Local authorities have ruled the death a homicide and are focusing their investigation on her boyfriend, Logan Eccles. I need your help, Veronica. I don't really do that anymore. What's this? I specifically told the agency and eager to please brunette. Dick. Hey, Logan, that girl who follows you around is here. Nine years of radio silence, and yet I still kind of knew I could count on you. We are going to the reunion. I'm shocked you even came to this. I knew you'd be here. You've been sitting there since graduation, haven't you? Veronica Mars. Look who it is. Most likely to blog and class buzzkill. You are just who I was looking for. Most likely to know where I can find the bar. Gross. No. Veronica, this is the whole case file. How'd you get this? I'm sure you know breaking and entering is a felony. Come on, I knew the felonies before I knew the state capitals. So are you gonna ask if I did it? I wouldn't be here if I thought you did. America thinks he's guilty, and that's good enough for me. I know Logan has his qualities, but there's a darkness to that kid. There's just so much going on here right now. I just couldn't leave. Sure you could. Wait. Don't go. I'm on to something, Dad. It's big. Just the tip of the iceberg. Everyone is on the take. Veronica, whatever you're doing, please be careful. Come on. My needs are simple. What are you gonna use your stun gun on me? Don't you think that's gotten a bit old? Original enough for you? I spent two years thinking about one moment. 
He's set me up. In our world, you always go back. He just left him there. That's what I can't forgive. That's my boy. Yo, T, I'm really happy you're home. Boys, we miss you, brother. It's time to celebrate. Call up some females. Do you know any pretty ones? You like them? Yo, mama? <laughs> <laughs> what are you thinking, Toby? This could put him away for life. It's time we make him pay. But first, we're gonna need a fast car. Y'all ready? We're doing this. Racing is an art. Revenge will surely come. But racing with passion, that's high art. And I think that's Toby Marshall driving the chariot of the gods. I'm willing to give six million dollars to anyone who puts a stop to him. We'll settle this behind the wheel. APB out for your arrest in 10 states. Maybe we should rethink the plan. I'm never gonna stop. Hook up! You are out of your mind. <laughs> I love it. Join us next week for another episode of Popcorn Picks.